Hi and welcome to another MI How To video. My name is Tom Clark and on today's How To, we are going to show you the seventh axis from Roland. Here to help us out is Rick, 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 Rick. What are you doing? You can't reach that. Just move the ladder over. Come well, on, I never thought of that. Well, it's a little bit easier, huh? Yeah. You know, Rick, I, I got the same problem. See, I got this six axis robot and it doesn't have the reach I need and that means I got to buy you know, a, a robot that can reach or, you know, go for longer distances. It's going to cost like a hundred thousand dollars and I'm trying to save up for my vacation fund. What if you move the robot back and forth? Just through some programming. Well, that's crazy talk, Rick. Actually, it's not so difficult. We lift the robot up, install right. the actuator below it, right. a few programming changes, some hardware, and the little robot covers the same as the big robot. So simple programming. I mean, what do you mean? Certainly, it's all supported by the robot manufacturer, but what we do, we get a smart guy. You, you brought a smart guy, didn't you? I brought a smart guy. Who'd you bring? Chris. Hey, Chris. Hey, You're the smart guy. Yeah, that's me. Okay, so tell me about this. So you see the uh, manufacturers of these six-axis robots already have the platform for the seventh axis built in. So it's uh, no separate controller. Uh, it's all the same language. It's, it's pretty easy. So. All right, let's see it. Yeah, yeah. I want to see how this works. Sure. Oh, yeah. Oh, I'm liking this already. Brings me back to the days of Robbie the Robot. You know, I am going to look like a hero on this by not buying a second robot or a larger robot. But, of course, you got to think about cost. So how much am I saving by using the seventh axis solution? A typical six axis robot of this size will run you about $50,000 with a reach of 750 millimeters. Okay. To upside to a larger robot with a 1500 millimeter reach would probably cost you about 150000 So it's much more economical to take the smaller robot, add the seventh axis, and the seventh axis will run you about 25000 Wow. So to save you guys the high level math, that's a cost of 75,000 for the seventh axis solution and $150,000 for the larger robot. It's half the price. That's amazing. So any place where I've got the six axis, I need more reach. The seventh axis is gonna be a huge price advantage and I don't have to buy a new robot. Yeah, and it's easy to do. Yeah. There are already some standard models pre-configured on the Motion Industry website. But if you need a specific stroke or additional features, we can customize the actuator to your specifications. It's easy. Now, if only we could put the actuator under the ladder, right? Yeah. Rick, Great. thanks so much, Chris. I appreciate it. Thank you. Awesome. That is Rick and Chris, and they are with Rollon. And if you have any questions about anything you saw here today, you can contact your nearest Motion Industries branch location, and they'll be able to help you out. Or you might be able to call the robot, I'm not sure. Hey, we didn't have any PPE on today, but remember, that's always priority number one. Wear the proper PPE for whatever the job calls for. You have to be safe. Priority number two, head to mihowto.com and check out more videos with me, Tom Clark, as your host. Hey, thanks so much for watching. We'll see you next time. Nice job.